Alrighty, the Parks and Recreation Department is currently working on a one-mile trail expansion at West Wetland Park. I was able to check out the current construction and get the latest details. Extending the West Wetland Trail will make an even longer path for locals. Yuma is known for having an amazing trail network. By building and developing this extension, an individual will now be able to go from the west side of the West Wetlands all the way to the Pacific Avenue Athletic Complex, which is an amazing trail system that will connect the entire Colorado River. The Parks and Recreation Director is excited. This is a good example of how a certain improvement can not only make a park even better, but be a true amenity and something that the community can be excited about. With the new enhancements, it will bring more connectivity to the Yuma area. This particular project is coming to fruition because of a grant that we were awarded, and that grant required us to develop a trail system within a west, with, excuse me, within a wetlands area, which is exactly what we're doing. Locals will see construction in front of Centennial Beach for the next month before the rebuilding moves to Gateway Park. Reporting in Yuma, Melissa Zaremba, News 11. The trail is still open for locals to use, but the expansion won't be completed for another two months. All right, thank you, Melissa. And also, as we mentioned at the top of the show, today's Valentine's Day. Americans are willing to pay up to show their love this Valentine's Day across the U.S. People are expected to spend nearly $24 billion on this Valentine's Day and their gifts this year, according to the National Retail Federation. That's up nearly $22 billion from last year. As for what people will buy, they'll pretty much stick to the classics, candy, greeting cards, and flowers in that order. Top the list of most popular Valentine's Day gift items this year. Well, still to come on Sunrise, the January 6th investigation continues and the Trump ally is next in line why the committee is expressing optimism in his cooperation. Another warm day is expected for our Valentine's Day, but changes are in our forecast. I'll have those details coming up on what we can expect this week. Allergies, asthma, be prepared. The News 11 team has you covered with the Air Quality Index. See what you should prepare for each day, every day, on our local newscast. Sponsored by Imperial County Air Pollution Control District. Shopping online for a purple mattress? We get it. With the smart comfort grid made of super comfy yet ultra supportive hyperelastic polymer, that makes for some serious pressure relieving comfort and support. But which purple mattress is right for you? Come to Denver Mattress and test for yourself. And right now, save up to $700 on mattress and sleep system bundles. And rest easy knowing it's backed by our 365-night better sleep guarantee. Shop Denver Mattress today, your purple mattress headquarters.